Have you made any plans yet? She's only just arrived, Agnes. I haven't made any plans, no. I suppose you only recently learned that your father had let you down. Please don't speak ill of Daddy. I will say what I like in my own house. Not to me. I thought I might find a job. Would that be out of the question? Only if you wish to live with me. Well, I don't want to be idle. Perhaps there's a charity that could use my services. How generous and how suitable. That depends on the charity she chooses. But first we must attend to your clothes, my dear. You will go tomorrow with Ada to my dressmaker. And no black. But I'm in mourning. People here won't know when Henry died. You're making your debut in society. You are young and pretty and need to be shown to advantage. I don't want you hanging about on the edge of things like a lonely crow. Ada, remember, I want cheerful colors, whatever she says. But we must look out for some people with sons and daughters your age. That's true, I don't know anyone. Now you need to know we only receive the old people in this house, not the new, never the new. What's the difference? The old have been in charge since before the revolution. They ruled justly until the new people invaded. It's not quite as simple as that. Yes, it is. Well, I'm new. I've only just arrived. Marion, never mind that the Brooks have been in Pennsylvania for a century and a half. My mother, your grandmother, was a Livingston of Livingston Manor, and they came to this city in 1674. You belong to old New York, my dear, and don't let anyone tell you different. You are my niece, and you belong to old New York. Si te gustó este video, dale like, suscríbete y activa la campanita. Y aquí te van dos videos que estamos seguros te encantarán.